my name is Gulam Rabbani. I work in Bangladesh Center for Advanced Studies uh, in Climate Change Division as a research fellow. My research is actually the uh, salinity intrusion uh, associated loss and damage on rice production and uh, sources of drinking water in, in Shatkhira district, which is a coastal district of Bangladesh. According to the respondents, 81% uh, uh, of, the, of the total households said that high salinity has increased due to this cyclonic events and also the sea level rise and tidal surge. The sea water, saline water comes to the agricultural field and inundates the agricultural field, which actually adversely affect uh, the farmers by reducing the rice production. What we have found from this research is there are several varieties they could use to adapt with the silent intrusion in the soil and water that was given by the government of Bangladesh and it was working well before 2009 and people could really yield better. In 2009, there was a cyclone Isla. Due to that cyclone Isla, according to the most of the respondents, that the salinity in the soil has increased very high. So uh, the earlier low saline tolerant varieties were not working. So immediately in 2009, uh, all the farmers uh, in four studied villages, uh, they lost total rice production. And in 2010, um, uh, they also lost the, uh, the rice production and 2011 as well. So in, in, in these three consecutive years, the total loss uh, was uh, almost um, uh, 2 million US dollar. Well, there is complete uh, you know, field level evidence that the, uh, the farmers were unable to adapt uh, uh, with the available saline, saline and varieties because the salinity in the soil due to cyclone Isla uh, uh, has uh, increased very rapidly. So uh, uh, the science or the, or the uh, policy and institutions, whatever we say, they could not provide the, uh, the uh, you know, technology uh, to improve or to adapt these, uh, uh, these consequences for the farmers.